In Ueno Park, near the Ueno Toshogu Shrine, is a garden you can visit. If you enjoy seeing flowers, it is worth it, especially if your trip coincides with the viewing times for the flowers. The garden was founded in April 1980 to commemorate the friendship between Japan and China and features a variety of peonies. Wait, this is a video about dahlias. Okay, s stick with me on this one. There are two blooming periods for the peonies, one during the winter from New Year's to mid-February and shows about 40 varieties, and the second from mid-April to mid-May, which features about 160 varieties. The garden introduced dahlias, or tenjiku botan, as they are called in Japanese, in 2016 and has about 150 varieties, and their collection is still growing and evolving. There is an admission fee to get in, and the front kiosk will notify you if the flowers are not at their peak. We visited soon after they opened for viewing, so the blooms were not fully out. Even still, the variety of shades and colors were amazing. We also visited after some rain, and although the lighting was poor, the raindrops on the blooms added to their beauty. From certain points in the garden, the five-storied pagoda can be seen and makes for a lovely backdrop. Seasonal displays, like this pinwheel, also add to the garden. There are also other little displays throughout the garden to delight the viewers. Parasols help protect the blooms from the scorching sun. When it's out, that is. I also wrote a haiku. Tenjiku Botan. The round blooms full of color. I absorb their grace. In Japan, there are meetings associated with flowers, called hanakotoba. For dahlias, they symbolize good taste. You can see the pagoda in the background here. This bowl of water featured some beautiful blooms. I quite enjoy Japanese maples with their tiny leaves. Here's another seasonal display, with some fall chestnuts even. A confederate rose, which is actually a type of hibiscus. This little beetle was charming, but I'm sure he doesn't taste good. Some Higginbana, which featured in a previous video. I'll put the link in the description box below. And some more bowls of dahlias floating in water. And lastly, some bush clover, which also blooms in the fall. I hope these flowers help brighten your day. As always, thanks for watching.